Okay, let's start with the big one. This is the Arduino Maker VDOR 4000. This is powered by a Cortex MO Plus 32 MCU and is the uh, first Arduino board to have FPGA. It's got a micro HDMI connector. There's a LiPo battery connector, micro USB, uh, an MPI camera connector, 25 pin mini PCIe connector there on the end. All 22 headers have PWM. Then we have the Maker 1000. This is another Cortex MO Plus 32 bit powered Arduino board with eight digital IO pins and 12 with PWM. Uh, it's got a LiPo charging circuit there, so it can be battery powered or USB powered. And there's full BGN Wi Fi connectivity. This is the new Maker IoT carrier. This is fully programmable with a built in circular display there at the center. Uh, there are touch sensitive buttons around the outside, lots of sensors built into it like temperature, humidity, light gesture, proximity, grove connectors so you can add more external sensors and there's even a clip here for an 18650 lithium ion rechargeable battery. We've included some shields in the prizes. Uh, this is the Maker GPS shield, very compact little GPS unit there that fits straight onto the Maker form factor or with the included cable. You can connect that to any board uh, and add GPS to your project. This is the Maker RGB shield. This is a matrix of 84 full RGB LEDs. No need to solder. That clips straight onto the Maker form factor. The always popular Arduino sensor kit. This is a selection of all the top Grove sensors, all pre-wired on the PCB. So it's perfect for education if you just want to learn Arduino. It's got microphone, uh, buttons, pots, LEDs, temperature sensor, uh, there's an OLED screen, uh, lots of great stuff all bundled onto one board there. And that comes with the ever popular Arduino Uno. And then best for last, we're including an Arduino Lover t-shirt. So remember that your community challenge projects doesn't have to be big or complex. We're looking for creative and innovative projects. So head on over to the Arduino blog and submit yours before March 24th. Then we'll see you on the official Arduino Day live stream where we'll announce the winners on the 27th. See you there.